This is well-known atheist Seth Andrews. I consider Seth to be a friend. That may not be mutual, but we have exchanged congenial emails. And by the way, I love the voice that God's given him, but I do have an axe to grind about what he's saying. Listen carefully. We see transitional fossils, we see evolution in multiple species, we see an avalanche of evidence for evolution. We see an avalanche of evidence for evolution. Hear that? That's what they all say, but it just isn't true. There's an avalanche of evidence for speciation, that is varieties of dogs within the canine kind, from Great Danes to Chihuahuas, an adaptation where birds' beaks adapt, but that's not Darwinian evolution. There's not a snowflake, let alone an avalanche of evidence for Darwin's theory of man and apes having a common ancestor. I interviewed four evolutionary scientists, three of them from UCLA and USC, and none of them could come up with even one example. Watch this poor professor flounder as he tries to think of one example of Darwinian evolution. I have thousands of examples. Can you, can you give me one? I can give you, I can give you thousands, just once. We see an avalanche of evidence for evolution. I just want one observable evidence for Darwinian evolution. Yeah. He couldn't because there isn't any. It's all accepted by blind faith. See for yourself. Watch Evolution versus God free on YouTube. It's been seen by millions.